Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. This is your pick a card oracle message for Friday, December the 13th. I am using the Psychic Tarot for the Heart Oracle deck this week. I would like you to think of a situation or a question that you need guidance on or clarity and then pick a card that you are drawn to. Card number one, card number two, or card number three. I will timestamp it in the comment section so you can go straight to that card, click on it, and you will go straight to the message. I will give you 10 seconds to pick a card. If you need more time than that, just pause the video until you're ready to pick that card. So I will count to 10 right now. Okay. So for those of you who pick card number one, your message is moving on. And that is number eight of, where did it go? Sorry guys. Okay, change is a necessary part of the natural world. This is also true of relationships. As a person evolves, so must a relationship or it will stagnate. This card is a reminder to examine your current relationships to see if they still feed your soul and help you grow. Are you staying in a relationship because it seems okay and there's no real reason to end it, but you feel like something is missing? Do your relationships have substance and bring you joy? Are you able to be your authentic self in your relationship. This card suggests that it may be time to walk away in some respect. This can be an actual ending of a relationship or simply taking a break to soul search. This is your time. Give yourself the space and permission to determine what you need and what you want, and then decide if it can be found in the current relationship as it exists now. If not, it may be that important time to make some essential changes. Okay, so those of you who pick card number two, your message is find balance. You may find that matters of the heart require extra effort at this time. More and more demands may be placed upon you, requiring you to juggle your attention. Family gatherings, school commitments, requests for assistance, and other obligations may arise within a short period of time. Just breathe and remember to be flexible. Adapt your approach to each situation at hand. Know that you have the ability to keep everything and everyone in balance. You may also be called upon to play the role of mediator. This is time for compassion and understanding, and you are up to the task. Work with people individually, giving each position equal consideration. Help all involved to understand another viewpoint and find middle ground. Finally, in order to maintain balance, you yourself must be in balance, so it's vital that you take time for you. And for those of you who pick card number three, your message is seek the truth. And that is number seven. Intuition is a powerful ally, and now is a good time to follow and trust your inner promptings. It may be that all is not as it seems in some of your relationships. Use your psychic senses to determine which of your associations may be questionable. Trust in what your intuition is saying right now. As much as you'd like to trust these people or this person, it's important to question their motives. Be cautious about sharing your most private thoughts and feelings in order to avoid allowing yourself to be placed in, in a vulnerable position. Be diligent in physically scanning your interactions for possible deception. Be wary of one-sided relationships in which the other person is not participating fully or is avoiding obligations and responsibility. Now is the ideal opportunity to get to the bottom of this behavior. And certainly at all times, be sure that your role in your relationships is above board and based on honesty. All right, everyone. Have a great Friday. Bye-bye.